All rise. Uh, wait. They're not here yet. My sister should be here. Silence. All of you, please, remain seated for the moment. Mina Jutler, you have been convicted by the jury of the murders of Leanna Kavanagh, Andrea Tate, and Ben Tucker. Your intention was to kill, and you were successful. You killed each of them in the most unexpected and frightful ways. I must now sentence you for those murders. Leanna Kavanagh, Andrea Tate, and Ben Tucker were blameless victims. They simply had the misfortune to get in your way. A beloved daughter, a beloved mother, and a beloved son needlessly killed by you. I have seen no genuine remorse from you. You are a manipulative person who has told many lies and shifted the blame to try and save your own skin. If you weren't so malignant, you would be pitiful. Pitiful. As witnessed in this same courtroom where you held us hostage only days ago, a desperate last attempt to feel important, you failed. You were eager to leave a legacy. It is to be forgotten. Could you stand, please? Hello, darling. I, uh... don't really know where to start. Mina Jutler, for the murder of Liana Kavanagh, the only sentence I can pass on you is life imprisonment with a 25-year tariff. <laughs> Mina stole you from me. My everything. Stole you from so many of us. What? For the murder of Andrea Tate, I sentenced no, you to life right. with a tariff of 25 years. And for the murder of Ben Tucker, I sentenced you to life no. with a tariff of 25 years. No, no. No. You no. will remain in custody You've for got the me rest wrong. of your no, natural no. life. You've got me wrong. Take Miss Jutler down. Oh, God, no! 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 no. This is so messed up! No, please don't! Please! I'm free! Do something! Please! Please, my free! Help me! Help me, my free! Come on! But I know now that you're not really gone. You're not really lost forever. And we have so much to be grateful for. Our memories, our friends, our family. And they're the ones who will keep us going now. So I think we're ready to heal now. Because otherwise, what else is there? We just stay stuck in our rage, in our pain, our grief. We can't let that happen. We can't let it destroy us. We can't let it swallow us up. So to Andrea, to Ben, to my darling Leanna, I know you'll bloom here as you did in life. Rest well. 
We're at peace with you now. Please don't ignore me.